people are dying after Las Vegas attack, here's what concerned celebrities are doing. The news is still breaking about the horrific shooting that took place in Las Vegas, Nevada. So far, we know that 50 people were killed and many hundreds were wounded. Police are still investigating the motives of the shooter, as medical staff at local hospitals work to save lives. It is a terrible event that will be discussed for weeks, if not months to come. But, as the death count is still rising, concerned celebrities are up to no good. As the rest of the world tries to wrap their head around the senseless attack in Nevada while investigators search for answers and those who were affected are in a deep state of shock and grieving, celebrities are rushing to social media to spew their idiotic opinions. What they have to say will make you sick. Right now, what matters is our law enforcement getting to the bottom of this terrible attack. They need to investigate what made 64-year-old Stephen Craig Paddock open fire on a crowd of innocent concertgoers during an outdoor country western show. There might be new discoveries over the coming hours about this attack, including whether there are others involved. It is a time when people are scared. Families are suffering. Americans of all backgrounds need to come together in a show of love and support in the face of this evil. But, what are liberal elitists in Hollywood doing? Complaining about the Second Amendment, of course. According to Briet Bart, numerous celebrities have already jumped on Twitter to complain about the shooting, blaming our right to bear arms as the real culprit of this attack. Noted atheist and anti God advocate Richard Dawkins was particularly cruel in his attack on the Second Amendment. It seems like he was mocking the very people who were killed. At a time when we don't know the motives of the attacker and few details have come out about how he acquired a gun, these so called experts were quick to shoot their mouths off about their politics. American lives were lost. Many people were injured. Lives have been shaken. Yet, these hacks are so self absorbed, all they can care about is pushing their liberal views. They seem to do this every time something bad happens. Before they consider the details or the condition of the victims, they are ready with their liberal talking points. It's almost as if politics are more important to them than human beings. But, it's not always this way. They are quick to blame the use of guns when people are attacked in these highly visible, mass shootings. But, when radical Islamic terrorists mow down innocent victims in cars, they are silent. Why not criticize those attacks, celebs? Why not call out the real motives for these kinds of attacks or, at the very least, demand stricter car rental policies? It seems that unless there is a progressive cause to push, these celebrities have very little to say. I wonder if they'd be so quick to tweet and bicker if their families were in danger. Don't they understand that something awful has happened? Their callous and insensitive words won't bring comfort to those mourning. They certainly won't bring back those we've lost.